Hello everyone and welcome to this slightly um, unplanned, I the word impromptu, but uh, yeah, I hadn't really planned for today's stream. I was planning, uh, however, to stream last night, but that didn't happen um, because I still wasn't too well. I was still in Moldova, so I decided to do a stream uh, today before I fly out to Iceland in the morning. So as you can see, uh, I am now back home. I spent a very nice uh, week in Moldova. And uh, I'm just home for a very quick uh, pit stop. I landed landed in Luxembourg around 4 or 5 p.m. And I'm off again to Iceland tomorrow morning at 6, a painfully early start. Um, so this show is not going to go on for too long because I still need to unpack and repack. Um, I think I need to pack a lot of uh, warm clothes if some friends of mine have been arriving in Iceland already and uh, the weather isn't great. I thought that it's the first time they hold the tournament in April and I was, back to, was expecting some lovely uh, spring weather. It looks like what we will have instead um, is snow and four degrees at most. <laughs> But uh, regardless of the weather, I'm really looking forward to returning to Iceland. Um, I will be commentating with Simon. The tournament starts on Wednesday. So don't uh, forget to tune into that. It promises to be an exciting tournament. Uh, lots of great players who have... I can't even speak anymore. <laughs> too tired. Uh, players like Shiroff and Jobava, who are always a pleasure to follow. And hello to everyone uh, in the chat. Uh, Baku's made in 47, Hutch Lover, Sweet 16, good to see you all. Uh, as usual, I haven't really planned much for today, but I'm going to be playing um, on Lee Chess. Um, let me see. What is this? Why is nothing I'd prepared working? One, give me a second. Uh, shouldn't. Okay, here we go. Let me just fix the other one as well. Super annoying when when I prepare these things um, in advance and then it just don't work. This is something else I'd prepared here. Um, let me... Actually, I didn't prepare this tonight, but I prepared this another time. A different view, but uh, I think... Okay, it looks a bit weird now because... First of all, I'm still working on it. And second of all, we're not in the right uh, window. But if you give me one second. Okay. And now if we go to a game. Well, I, I don't have a new haircut, uh, John. It's just um, just decided to put my hair up. <laughs> um, just in a bit more relaxed setting here at home. Not get my dirty hair in the way. But this isn't now working either. What a mess. Why isn't this working? I had this all beautifully cut out earlier. But I'm not sure what happened there. It's this. So yeah, I had this uh, cut out, but I think this view is probably better anyway. Um, zoom in a bit. I've learned that I shouldn't mind if I just come up with these things as we go along. I think this should be fine. Um, yeah, good to good to see you all. I don't, yeah, not a not a new hair, crutches hair. Oh, so yeah, what's going to happen today? I'm just going to play a few games. Um, maybe give my opinion. Well, I don't have my. I was going to talk about uh, how busy the last few days have been. In the chess world, there's a lot going on. Um, the Zurich tournament just concluded today. The Granke Open, of course, the big stars um, are still playing, Magnus and Co. Um, maybe a first thought, let me know what you think. But I barely, um, barely followed uh, Zurich. Although it was such a strong field, I just... Time control wasn't very appealing um, to me. Too short to be a classical time control, but too long uh, to be even rated in rapid. So I was not, uh, I have to say, I just, just didn't appeal to me. I could barely, 
tell you any game that's uh, been played there. Of course, Baku's uh, what about who, who you found uh, crushing Kawan? A very impressive display um, display by who uh, you found. Also today, I think she did really well against Magnus. The game ended in a draw, but she was pushing. Um, she is on on two and a half out of three. A fantastic start uh, for Yifan. I think the tournament has a rest day tomorrow, which is good for me since I'm traveling. Uh, I'm traveling tomorrow, so that means I won't miss anything. And then I think the action now uh, resumes in Baden Baden on. Really bad with weekdays. What's today? Monday. So I think the action resumes on Wednesday. Um, okay, if you want to zoom board, just <laughs> thank you for this nightmare leeches. As you can tell, I'm still fairly new. Let me try and do this. Aha, nice. Okay, so I guess that means I can zoom out 200 again here. Just zoom in on the board. Is that good? Let me know what you guys think. But I think this looks goodish <laughs> to me. So thanks for that uh, nightmare leeches. Um, yeah, I can have 3D pieces, I think. <laughs> Just as confusing enough as it is. I'll stick with this for now. I think I changed the color last time. Um, yeah, I don't really have any preferences. So I'll stick with this for now. Uh, what else has been going on? Maybe I should uh, start playing and um, just talk as we go along. Actually, one uh, very random <laughs> story uh, is that just before I started the show, uh, Anton, who I guess is watching, is he watching? Are you watching? Um, Anton posted a, a GIF of me, which I'm going to show you guys, um, because I was telling Anton I was going to get something to eat, and uh, Anton came up with this beautiful GIF you can see here. And uh, what was funny about this was that literally uh, one second after I saw this, my brother called to say he was on the way. Um, he was on the way with pizza, and uh, so the, um, I'll show you that. That is me and my brother, uh, literally just twenty minutes ago. <laughs> Massive pizza there because my brother went on a big walk today. And what's happening is I don't see my brother very often. He used to play uh, chess when he was younger, so he might or might not be making a brief guest appearance later. Maybe we can team up for a game of hand and brain or something. It uh, would be fun. would be his first game of chess in about 10 years. So yeah, that's for the little random intro. Let's see what challenges I have. As I said, I think tonight is going to be slightly... Oh, I'll play Baku's. Um, uh, because Bakus was one of the people who very kindly uh, donated the other day, well, the other day, the other week, shall I say, and I also, I think, I fixed my donation button, but we won't find out unless uh, someone donates. Yeah, again, um, <laughs> still don't have an opening against D4, embarrassingly. Uh, playing random stuff again. And Anton is watching, uh, jealous of my pizza. Actually, I um, I couldn't even finish half of my pizza because I had to had to start the show. But I'll have a bit more after and back and sleep because tomorrow is going to be a long day. Tomorrow evening, the opening ceremony of Reykjavik. <laughs> I'm already struggling with my position. Um, Oh, I actually meant to go C6 here. What was I saying that um, I mentioned the other day? If the internet is good enough, I would love to stream uh, from Reykjavik. But again, that will depend on, um, on how good my connection is. 
And uh, I was talking to Simon and also do check out Simon's Twitter feed and his uh, Facebook page because Simon has been in Iceland already since Saturday and he hired a camper van. And he's, uh, for the last few days, he's been busy driving around Iceland in a camper van. So I imagine Simon is having a lot of fun right now. And Simon, um, Simon actually bought a video camera. So Simon was suggesting that we could uh, film some short videos and post them up on our YouTube channels. So that could be fun. So um, if I don't get to stream, maybe you'll just get some short, uh, fun YouTube videos instead. If you haven't subscribed to my YouTube page yet, you can find the link just below here. Um, what else? Anton uh, is pointing out I was supposed to work on my openings in Moldova. <laughs> Not quite sure what went wrong there. Um, yeah, maybe next time. <laughs> no, I, I, um, I urgently, urgently need a repertoire because I will be commentating in, um, in Reykjavik now, but then in May I will actually be playing loads of chess myself. So I definitely need to at least know what I'm doing against 1D4. And this game, I think, um, I think maybe uh, a move earlier, we go back there later, but I think I'm winning a piece now, if I'm not mistaken. I think if you want to challenge me, um, I'd be quite happy to mostly play variants because I didn't get much sleep last night, I had an early flight. And I really want this to be a, a fun, fun stream, nothing too serious. I don't want to be discussing my lack of a black repertoire against D4. Yeah, this position, um, I think it's just very difficult. Can I go knight B3? I think if you piece up, swapping some pieces is not a bad idea. Yeah, things went wrong here a, bit, a few moves ago. And this now, lack of sleep or not, I should be able to wrap up. Hi, Martin Kessler and uh, Gary Topalov. Welcome to the chat. I'm always very happy to see some new names because um, a lot of people have been watching what I do for a while, but very happy to see some new uh, new names. So welcome to the show. And uh, actually, earlier I was talking uh, to my friend Asios about the Leeches Marathons. Um, I have to say, I haven't even played a normal tournament on Lee Chess yet. But I was uh, thinking that one of the things I would love to try in the long term is to play in one of the Lee Chess marathons and stream my efforts. I think that would be a lot of fun. It would also be extremely tiring, um, but hopefully mostly fun. But then next marathon isn't until August, so a lot of time to still think about that. And there was a, a comment on one of my YouTube's, YouTube videos from San, uh, San Diego the other day that maybe sometime I should drink water instead of wine. So cheers, cheers to you, San Diego. Actually, believe it or not, um, one of my resolutions for Iceland is to be more sensible. More sensible than I maybe usually am. Um, can I take this pawn with the rook? I guess so. I guess I can also just take it with the chip. Yeah, um, Martin Kessler, am I German? No, I'm uh, Luxembourgish. Um, Steil, yeah, Steil is a could be German, but it's a Luxembourgish name. So I'm half, half Luxembourgish, half French, the Anthony part my mom's name. She's from Corsica. 
and chess success he did the marathon the whole 24 hours wow that is crazy i mean i don't think i could do that I imagine you were uh, very exhausted by the end um now just let me wrap this up i'm a whole piece up just need to just need to and i wonder if that's my brother i can hear in the background um, I wonder, I actually, I wonder if my brother is going to come in at some point because he said it would be embarrassing, but we'll see. Um, now, how do I wrap this up? This is terrible. Terrible endgame technique. Let me bring my book to the third rank and hopefully I need to... Uh, still annoying. So the threat was g4, of course. I'm making a real mess out of this. But okay, I guess now he has to swap rooks and... Is that it? That should be it, I guess. Would be pretty embarrassing. <laughs> If I manage to mess this one up, but I don't don't think I can. Uh, White will always find himself in Su Tsuang at some point, and then I'll just be able to go and uh, collect his pawns on one of the both flanks. So not a smooth start there, but I got there in the end. Thanks for the game, uh, Bakus. Um, and yeah. On to the next game. What do we have? Chess nine sixty. Okay, I'll go for I'll go for three check against Chess sucks. I think Chess sucks beat me in the, one of the last streams I did. Um, <laughs> there's a question in the chat um, from uh, from Tunguska sixty four asking if David. Um, If David Howell is a bit mad in real life, yeah, we had a bit of an accident in the last stream. I'm not going to talk about it too much because I think David got away with not too many people having seen it. Um, David is a bit mad, but in, in a good way. What is this? Oh, we're playing tree check! <laughs> totally forgot we were playing tree check. I was like, what is this guy doing? <laughs> How embarrassing was that? Okay, so he has two checks already. What an idiot I am. That's what happens when you talk too much and don't focus enough. Okay, so I need to stop him from giving any, any check. <sighs> Will my king be safe if I castle? Yeah, typical. <laughs> um, commands. Oh dear, what's that? Some more King's Crusher. Yeah, I, I saw that. I think King's Crusher is streaming right now as well, isn't he? So Knight F2, I think, is, threatened, is the threat here. Followed by Queen H4. Yeah, I, I like to play tree check but not when I forget it is tree check and allow two checks within the first four moves. Oh dear. Okay I'll have to uh, yeah I should play hand and brain with David again someday. I was really sad the stream um, the quality wasn't what I'd hoped for. But as you say, um, there will be other days. I Actually, I really hope when I see David in the Forenciel that we can play some live, um, that we can have a live stream when we're actually in the same room. Because I, as I explained last time, um, I especially bought a new, new laptop to stream. It turns out uh, it's just not powerful enough to stream and have Skype on at the same time. So I think this, uh, my solo streams, like the one I'm doing right now, I think they are working fine. But as soon as I um, 
as soon as I pay. Or he wants to take, okay, I'll take his piece. Um, I was <laughs> totally losing the, the thread here. I win his queen. I managed to trap his queen. If I can get his queen, then I'm not in so much danger of him getting too many checks in anymore. Um, and Martin, actually, I don't think... I, I mean, I have uh, two very good moderators. Anton is one of them. And um, I, I don't actually think that I need so many moderators in here. I think in general, people are very nice. And um, I always enjoy my streams. I enjoy the atmosphere. I enjoy the fact that there aren't really many trolls in the chat. Um, and yeah, uh, our, our Kodos, or RC, I'm not sure how to pronounce your name. I was actually thinking of um, maybe starting a, not a fundraiser, but maybe on here, to have a little bar uh, to make donations more fun and to make them go towards something that will actually help me stream. Because as I said, so uh, that's what I was just saying. Um, I bought a laptop just for streaming, but it turns out I need more power. Um, so I'll need to look into buying a proper PC. Until then, I will refrain from streaming uh, with Skype guests. And Let me win this game now. I'm a queen up. Okay, he has two checks already, but my king should be really safe. Let me. I've lost, <laughs> lost the chat. Um, okay, what's the best way to go on about this? Let me bring the bishop back. I'll protect my king. Am I making, why am I making life so difficult for myself again? Why? Why, why, why? Is this, do we have an increment? No, we don't have an increment. Oh, oh, that's bad news. That's bad, bad, bad news. I just have to win this <laughs> position on, on, position is what I'm trying to say. I mean, this, oof, I got there in the end. I can't believe I won this game after starting out the way I did with two checks in the first four moves because I'd forgotten about the um, about the fact I was playing tree check. Uh, let me just catch up uh, with the chat because I had a slight problem there. So what did I miss? Uh, someone was trolling. Anton is an excellent uh, mod, let me just say that. He's actually so good. He always uh, bends me as soon as he gets the chance. Uh, luckily for me, he can't bend me from my own stream. Um... Um, hello, Larson. Yeah, Larson. I remember Larson from last time. Um, Larson, you didn't tell me who you were. Larson was claiming to be from the same town as me. Uh, yeah, chess sucks. <laughs> sorry, sorry about this. <laughs> just look at the way I started this game if you're just joining now. So what happened is that, as usual, I did a lot of uh, talking. <laughs> I sometimes think I talk too much and totally forgot that this was three check. So here I played the brilliant move d4, allowing a first check and allowing a second check here. So um, I think I'm really lucky to have won that game because not a good start. Um, Mate in 47 is saying, uh, asking if I'm playing in Iceland or commentating. I'm only commentating. 
uh, only commentating, uh, playing and commentating at the same time. <laughs> be a bit too much, I reckon. But no, I'm commentating. And commentating, um, I think sometimes people are under the impression that commentating is an e easy job. And I'm not claiming it's the most difficult job in the world, but um, it's pretty tiring, actually, when you um, talk for five hours. You just get one or two breaks. Um, I mean, it's a lot of fun, but it is quite tiring. So only commentating on the brackets. Um, yeah, <laughs> talking and playing is also really hard. Okay, so I have a lot of challenges. Uh, what do I want to? Let me play a game of uh, King of the Hill. And I'll try to remember this in the normal game of chess. I think with King of the Hill, it's not quite as bad. Um, because let's say my opponent goes king e2 now, and I'm bound to remember that this is a king of the hill while we pre check. I only remembered when he when, once he took on c3. And yeah, Larson, you did promise indeed. I never remember the move order here. I never remember if I have to go knight f6 or knight c6. Knight c6? f6? Oh. Sometimes I think I should take away a week off of everything. <laughs> Just have a look at my repertoire. Because I, I haven't really played so much chess lately, and I, I do actually have openings. I just can't remember any of them. And most of the time, that's fine. Uh, most of the time, not too many people notice, but when I'm streaming, it's pretty embarrassing. Yeah, chess sucks. Yeah, that's a good point about um, King of the Hill. I think it's mostly decided in the end game. And not too many crazy people. And this one hasn't gone. Not happy with how this has gone at all. Pretty much given right everything he can dream of here, I think. Someone's asking where I live. Um, again, tell me how to pronounce your name. Is it R. Jodos or is it... Let me know. Um, I do live in Luxembourg again. Uh, quite a recent development, me moving back home. But I, in fact, I don't really live anywhere because I travel so much. Um, travel so much that I don't really have a home home. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't castle again. Thanks for the advice, Hutch Lover. Um, as I said a few times, I'm just starting out, so still a lot for me to learn, especially in all the variants. Um, the Truth ICC, welcome. Is it Tuesday already? It isn't. <laughs> Monday. Um, I was wondering whether I'd be able to stream right on Tuesday tomorrow, but I very much doubt it because uh, it's the opening ceremony of the Reykjavik Open, and then after that there's Champions League on. Um, so I think it's not going to happen tomorrow. Also, I'm slightly worried that the internet will not be good enough anyway um, in Iceland to allow me to stream. This game is a total disaster. Total, total disaster. I know Top Chess and ABR 2015. Who am I rooting for? I, is that about the Champions League? If I assume, I assume it is. But I personally cheer for Liverpool, so I haven't had uh, much to cheer for in the Champions League. Since 2005. I also need to speed up, I think. I'm just, just not happy here. Um, in the Champions League, I always like to do the underdog 
do well. So I hope I hope uh, Leicester go through. And I also have a big dislike of Real Madrid, so I wasn't happy with them uh, beating Bayern in Munich. Um, so I hope Leicester go through and Real go out. That's pretty much all I hope. Okay. Um, Leith, uh, Leith Bridge Chess was asking me about Iceland and I think and about uh, Ingvar. If Ingvar is commenting, the truth is I don't actually know. <laughs> I don't know. Simon and I will be the main commentators. But I guess Ingvar will be making one or the other uh, guest appearance. Ho I hope so at least. Uh, Ingvar was always my partner in Iceland so far. And in this game, I've definitely done too much talking and too little playing. Sweet <laughs> um, 16, who is my favorite chess player? I have to go with Morozovic. Morozovic has been my favorite um, forever and ever. And um, I, I became a fan of Morozovic. When I started playing chess, uh, my dad took me to see the tournament in Dortmund, I think in 2001, must have been 2001 or two, 2001, summer of 2001, and uh, Morozovic played a brilliant game. I think he played a King's Gambit or something like that, and I was just really impressed. I love his chess. I asked him for an aut autograph afterwards. He was really kind, as well as being a fantastic player. So ever since then, um, really liked Morozovic. I think when when I was young, I was just a super fan, and then I I actually got to know him, and he's a, a really nice person as well. So, be a great, great person and a great chess player. What more can you ask for? Now my pos I think my position is actually good. What isn't good is my time situation, and my king's uh, <laughs> my king is in all sorts trouble so I'm going to try and swap queens. I just missed my e7 which still works now. Ah, but I'm slow. But I'm slow and now e, this pawn is hanging. I mean what am I actually doing? I tried to bring my king up the hill. I mean I just dropped a piece as well with rook e8 which thankfully he didn't see. But uh, he's just going to get a queen. So I'll try. I'll try this. My last, <laughs> my last trick. But I doubt it's going to work. Yeah. Well done. Uh, well done, Sonata Two. Next time I'll try. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Still recovering from my cold, and my throat is a bit sore. Um, Let is going to Iceland. Who is Let? Uh, the truth, ICC. Kondilu, um, I'm not going to play a tournament today because today is going to be a somewhat uh, shorter, shorter stream. Um, but I promise, as soon as I do a proper stream, I, I will play a tournament to give you all a chance uh, to play and beat me. Um, and then. Uh, let, oh, what did you say? Let is going to Iceland. Well, <laughs> just uh, make yourself known to me. Maybe I know who you are already. And it's always difficult when I just see the usernames, and I'm not sure if I know the person behind the username or not. But uh, I'm looking forward to seeing you in Iceland regardless. And uh, nice to see me play for once. Well, I try to play sometimes. Um, how do you fly from Lethbridge? Maybe we're on the same flight. That would be quite funny, because I'm flying. Um, I'm flying from Birmingham. Okay, what else? Should I try a game? Okay, let's play a game of Crazy House. I'm ape in super shape. In case you are watching, I would love to play Crazy House, but the time control is a bit too long. Ten minutes plus uh, six seconds. So if you want to challenge me again, actually, can I challenge him? How do I do that? <laughs> I'm terrible at this. 
Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Is that how I do this? Okay. Uh, crazy house. Uh, 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 uh. I didn't didn't challenge him to any time control. Unlimited. No, I didn't want to do that. Ah oh, dear. <laughs> Oh dear, this is a mess. I should really familiarize myself with, um, <laughs> with the site, but I will. I'm sorry about that. Oh, Let is from Canada. Oh, and you're coming with a man. I had no idea. Um, man, a man playing in uh, in Reykjavik. So I saw a man was playing in the Krenke Open. Um, so he started really well, unfortunately lost this morning, but I didn't realize he was playing didn't realize he was playing in Reykjavik. I had this. Yeah, so sorry about that unlimited challenge. Uh, whoever. Ah, here we go. Five minutes. Perfect. Thank you. Five plus five. Still quite long, but okay. Let's see how it goes. Thank you also for the follows. I would absolutely love it. Um, someone donated tonight because I've been working on the donation button and even if it's just a one euro or one dollar donation I'd love to see if um, I managed to fix it but if not it's fine <laughs> totally fine of course and again I should remember that this is should remember that this is a crazy house so let's take here I think Crazy House is probably one of my favorite, uh, favorite, <laughs> can't even speak, uh, favorite variants. It's a lot of fun, I'm just not sure how good I, <laughs> how good I am at it. Um, but always fun. I loved playing Dark House when I was younger. I, I don't really want to put it on here, but let's keep my king safe. Uh, okay, thanks for the messages, Lois, and I'll have a look later. And uh, Rashid, uh, what's my next destination? Well, as, as I said earlier, I'm off to Iceland uh, just tomorrow. Actually, that's why the reason... Um, yeah, this, I don't want to remove this night. If only I had a partner who could give me some pieces. Um, okay, hopefully I can take advantage of these holes here at some point. Um, so the, I said earlier, the reason, one of the reasons this stream isn't going to go on for too long, uh, oof, this isn't great, is that I have a, a 6 a.m. flight. Oh, I didn't see a tree is hanging as well. What am I doing? <laughs> What on earth am I doing? I already see the forks coming up as well. Oh dear. All right, I'm going to resign this game. <laughs> And move away from this queen as fast as possible. Well done, um, ape in super shape. I'll, I'll give you a rematch someday where I'll try not to embarrass myself quite as badly. This is absolutely horrendous. Okay, let me uh, play one game of standard chess just to recover from this absolute disaster. Um, Touch Lover is asking if I saw Simon's stream last week. I think I know which stream we are referring to, but uh, unfortunately I missed it. And uh, unfortunately I missed it. And next day when I tried to find the stream on Twitch, he'd already deleted it. <laughs> so I did I did talk to Simon since then, but not about the stream. But I'll make sure, make sure to ask him about it tomorrow. Again, this 
is a line I'd looked at. Once upon a time. Once upon a time. Thanks for following. Make it. Okay, so and in general I'm quite happy with these kind of positions if you um, if you've seen me play before and thank you for tuning in Bakus uh, see you another time and I take this guy is it more important I complete my diff be more important I complete my development. Do I want to go here or here? It's here. A mate in 47 uh, is hoping Anish will win the tournament in Iceland. He deserves to win the tournament. Actually, that's one of the things I'm very curious about uh, in regards to Reykjavik Open. I'm very curious to see how uh, Anish is going to do because I don't recall him playing in an Open in a little while. He did play in the Qatar Masters, but it's a very strong Open. Uh, there's also a rating cap. But um, there will be a lot of very hungry players. Hungry in a just sense, of course, in Reykjavik. And I, I'm very curious to see how Anish is going to do against uh, that field. Uh, I think he might have a tough thing. My opinion is that he might have a tough time because um, I don't know if his style is uh, designed for these kind of tournaments. I think Anish is, there's no denying he's a very, um, very solid player. I wonder if I could have trapped this knight a few times already, but yeah, he's a very, um, very solid player. And he will be up against players, from, I think, is he the top seed? I think he's the top seed, so all of his opponents will be lower rated. I'm not saying he will do badly, but uh, I think he will need to post a very big score to um, not lose rating. And my bet would be that he won't win the tournament. And am I in either corn? I am indeed for another, <laughs> another what? It's 8 o'clock now? Another 9 hours? 8 hours? Okay, now this knight, I mean, what is this knight doing on e5? Uh, surely I have to have to trap that somehow. We will we'll go to g4. But. I, of course, he also has c4. But I was thinking if I go queen e4, for example. My brain is just working very slowly today. Yeah, play a five for now, but I really like my position. I just need to hurry up. Um, do I think Aman will make GM? Of course he will. I think it's just a matter of time um, until he makes GM. But I have absolutely no doubt that Aman uh, will be a GM sooner. Rather than later. I think at next up I'm just going to develop my pieces. I have this semi-open file with the bishop hitting f2. This knight doesn't really have many. I mean, my position must be really good. It's just a matter of um, making it even better. So I want to try and get to g6 now. Threaten bishop h3. I guess king, king goes somewhere, but now after he played rook e1, the problem is that after king h2 or king h1, f2 will be hanging, and if he goes king f1, surely that can't be any good. Now I think I can just take this. e4 is hanging. That shouldn't be. Let's just remove the cable. Um, 
And then in the end, F2 is hanging. When E4 isn't even hanging. Sorry, guys. <laughs> really. I'm talking so much nonsense tonight. It's unreal. Uh, I don't know if the fact I had a, a long day is an excuse, but the quality of the chest tonight has been absolutely horrendous. This was hanging as well. I mean, I'm, I'm winning anyway, but there must have been smoother ways to wrap this one up. Um, where do we go? Let's go here. Oh, Queen G3, of course. I don't play it. I won't play it since you guys told me the move, of course. Um, Queen G3 was winning. And that's that. Um, again, <laughs> not very smooth conversion, but thanks for the game, Darko. And um, yeah, that's that. Uh, okay. So, what else can I try? Maybe another tweet. Ah, uh, uh, but it's okay. I'll get a, a rematch against Chess Socks in in tweet check. Except this time I made myself a memo um, that it is it is tree check. Apparently I didn't make <laughs> my memo wasn't very good if I went one e five. Will he take? Will he give me his bishop? When will be my next uh, Chess24 stream, asks, asks Boundless uh, Board. I'm not sure yet. I don't really plan these things in advance. At the moment, I think I'm mostly just wondering when's my next stream full stop because um, I will be traveling loads. And the problem with traveling, traveling is great, of course, but when it comes to streaming, uh, is that I never know in advance how good uh, my internet connection will be and whether it will allow me to stream or not. So at the moment, as I say, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know when my next stream will be, but hopefully soon. And um, I have to say, at the moment, I'm quite enjoying playing on Lee Chess. I really love the um, variants and the community. I, I will play on Chess24 and Chess.com as well in the future. And Matin, uh, Matin 47, thanks for tuning in. Um, I will definitely have fun in Iceland. And see you another time. I think this position I'm quite happy with because um, it's quite similar, but uh, the big difference is that his bishop is completely closed here behind the pawn while my bishop threatening to give a check already. Um, is this risky? I don't think so. I guess he would try to get e4 in at some point. Uh, watching the, you're watching the video where I play on chess. I guess you mean the, the my attempt at Title Tuesday ABR. I did stream. Um, I did stream the Title Tuesday attempt a couple of weeks back. I started very well, <laughs> ended quite painfully. Okay, let's go here because I want to. If I can't get any checks in, I want to attack him at least. So I want to go f4, f3, and I played King h8 first. Um, to stop any. Stop. Any bishop h7 ideas. Also slightly concerned about going f4 now to op opening up everything. Maybe I can develop my queen first here. I wasn't sure whether to put my queen on f6 or h4, but I think I'm quite happy um, with this. A lovely bite. Hi there. Not used to women swimming. Yeah, 
I, I was actually wondering this. Um, I don't actually know if there's any other woman uh, chess streamer. Well, obviously there are women streamers, but chess, I don't... I'm not quite sure. Can I take this one? What's his follow-up? I guess we'll have to find out. If it takes, I can even have to think about whether I want to take with it. But here I'll swap queen. I'll probably just take another pawn. I'm not being too greedy here. I need to do something about this bishop though, and quickly. Bishop is a major pain. I think if he takes, I'll probably just go f4. Closing down this bishop. I'll be opening his light squared bishop, but um, closing the other one. I will have to get one check in at some point. Yeah, that's true. Sopico does banter blitz, but then I mean, if you count Sopico, you'll have to count Anna, etc., etc. So I think we are in streams per se. This is a good move. I might be in some trouble on this diagonal. How do I deal with this? How do I deal with this? Bishop f5, I was thinking of that. Okay, let's go for that and then after c4, I'll go rook g5, I think. What's the time? Oh, there's no increment, so I'll have to speed up as well. I'll have to speed up. Uh oh. I think this is the moment where I start panicking. <laughs> this was, of course, an absolute joke of a move. Yeah, and this is it. I'm lost after knight to rook g7. I panicked there in the end. Uh, GG, chess sucks. If we go back a few moves, I think uh, I was okay. But here after C, I I mean, my trouble started here. Anyway, I'm not going to analyze too much. Um, well, c4 would have been genius. Um, yeah, just catching up with the chess, uh, the jet, <laughs> lovely bite. I do play some standard chess as well, but I was saying tonight, um, it's quite a short stream. I've had a long day, so I was mostly just going to play some fun chess tonight, but I've played a few standard games. I'll play another now, and then I will play uh, a game of 960. Let's see. Let's play Xernix. And also, I, I've had a few comments on YouTube about... Um, about people wanting me to solve tactics. Uh, let me know in the chat what you think about that. I, I said to that person who contacted me that I, um, I would love, I will probably in the future try and end every stream with a 15 minute uh, tactic, tactic session, but not, not tonight because I'm on, on the verge of collapsing as it is. Because I promised promised the stream yesterday, which I didn't do. I thought I I do one last stream um, before I go home. What am I doing again? Can I play b5? Hopefully. Um, keep losing track of what I say as well. Yeah. So uh, no tactics tonight, but in general, what do you think of the idea? Of solving tactics on stream. Very aggressive, this guy. 
Is there an X? Very interesting, very strange move actually. Can I play knight d4? I guess so. Don't tell me it's going to be so greedy and take this pawn. It's very, st I mean, <laughs> not a structure you see every day, this e7, f6, g5. And what do you say, Chessox? Three zero is too short. Too short for what? For tree check? Yeah, maybe. I think I feel that in general um, <laughs> I need a lot of time for any variant. And this, I mean, don't try this at home. Playing with this structure, I guarantee you can't be good. I have many options here. I can play. I'll probably play this first. So do I give a check first? And I have so many, so many moves. See, yeah, I'll play this first and play, follow it up with knight e6. And I mean, this looks absolutely horrible for black. Being a bit quiet, <laughs> I think this this I think I will stream until nine thirty my time. So that's another twenty five minutes because my voice <laughs> starting to de to desert me already, um, and I really needed to be back by mon by Wednesday when, as I said, I will be commentating with Simon. The Reykjavik, Reykjavik Open, of course. I hope to see you some of you guys uh, on that chat as well. And this. So if I give a check again, king here. Looking, pretty much looking for a finish already here. And I played this and then queen b4. Ah, but then he has knight h6, is that it? Knight h6 I can take on knight fa. <laughs> Remember, it's not tree check yet. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's a good point, uh, true of ICC. Knight b5, yeah, knight b5 was probably also strong. Uh, I think in a position like that, must be many many good moves. Uh, do I play chess 960? Yeah, I was just going to say that after this game I had one challenge chess 960. I was going to, to try that. I said in during my previous uh, one of my previous streams that I actually once played an over the board uh, chess 960 chess 960 tournament. This was when the tournament in Mainz uh, still existed. Yeah, I was saying that I have knight check here, but I'm not sure how good. Let's just take it. Uh, there, there used to be a very strong rapid tournament in Mainz, Germany. So I played in that once, uh, Chess 960 over the board, which was a lot of fun, actually. Very enjoyable experience. Um, very different from, from your usual tournaments, of course. Um... How what's the best way to include this somehow? Can I? Knight c5, did I miss a mate? Oh dear. <laughs> dear, dear. I, I think I'm just basically staring at this position in disbelief. Yeah, I, I won on time, but if we go to the analysis board, surely this must be close to mate in the end. 
Yeah, let's see. Okay, it looks like no mate yet. Plus 17. Must be good enough. Did I miss a knight c5? Eight at some point? Back. Uh, <laughs> and here's Zernik, sorry about that, uh, I think things went wrong pretty early in this game actually here. <laughs> I don't think f6 and g5 is really the way to go here. Then apparently, I mean even here, I just don't think it has time to go b6 and bishop b7 because I have five and this is just a very very nice position for white but anyway enough of the analysis this is my chest line 60 oh my chest line 60 challenge disappeared i only have racing kings and atomic none of which i'm going to accept so let's play kings king chaser Another standard game. I am hoping for no d4. Okay, this is good. Not that my openings are much better against e4, but at least I have one or two. Whoa, what just happened there? Let me quickly save my laptop before disaster happens here. Oh no, not the Evans Gambit. And I think... I think I have a slight lag. I hope it's okay on your side. Proof ICC, please don't tell me I'm offline. Yeah, no, my stream is lagging as well. Okay, let me focus on this game. It looks like it's back, but so annoying. So the reason 